He nearly lost his life in a terrible crash, but with a team of stellar doctors and an incredible network of support, Jake Moore not only survived, he is thriving now. And Jake is your Heartland Coca-Cola coin toss captain for tomorrow's Chiefs Chargers game. He joins us now along with his wife, Sarah, and the doctor who helped save his life, Dr. Stephen Glorsky. Thank you all for being here. I want to start with Jake. How are you feeling today? I'm good. Feel good. Great. Can you tell us a little bit about what happened? What I remember was I was fixing my brother's motorcycle that day, and I took it for a ride to see if I fixed it right, and I wrecked. And then next thing you know, you woke up in Nebraska. Yep. After all the heavy lifting had been done here yep. by doctors like Dr. Glorsky, who saved your life, what did they tell you had happened to you? That I was in a wreck, and I'm lucky to be here. I woke up to my family staring at me. Oh my gosh, and we'll, we wanna talk to Sarah in a moment. I have to ask Dr. Glorsky, you were one of the first doctors of this huge team that saw Jake within hours of him being brought into the hospital. What did you think and what did you have to do to save his life? Well, um, we uh, basically brought Jake into a very well-organized, complex system with multiple participants and unfortunately he is not atypical. We see many severely injured patients at the University of Kansas Medical Center and we, uh, we gave him the best we had. And there were so many people who contributed to his care, um, not only all of my six partners, but our, our nurse practitioners, our ICU nurses, um, multiple uh, surgical subspecialists, medical subspecialists, uh, rehab team, um, so this is uh, a very proud example of uh, the work we do every day. Jake, they, they told you that it might be a year before yeah. you were walking again, talking again because of a brain injury. Yes. This was in April. It was, end of April. I mean, five months later, you're on TV, walking, talking perfectly, and you beat all the odds. Yep, thanks to guys like him. Yes. And my family. And your family. And that's when I want to ask Sarah. Sarah, you're a mother of two beautiful little kids. Um, little kids. Yes. You talked about how this, this is the first time really that Jake is now finally meeting and talking to Dr. Glorsky, but <clears throat> this doctor was by your side the whole time. Oh, Tell okay. us what that meant to you. It was him and also a, a bunch of other crew. They're, they were marvelous. They were there with us the whole way. You're getting choked up. Yes, I am. <laughs> totally understandable. One thing that you said was that Dr. Glorsky gave you hope, he which did. was better than any medicine you could have ever gotten. Yes. What was it like to get hope, and when do you remember feeling like, okay? Having him telling us that he's doing better each day and every minute of the day, seeing something different, made us feel there was more hope for our kids and to be together. And you finally felt like that was the moment you could bring your children yes, to see their dad. They, our kids didn't get to see their dad for a whole month because he was in ICU and I didn't think it was appropriate to have our kids see their dad not able to talk or move or give him a hug or a kiss and that broke my heart so we it was a hard decision but it was worth it to not have memories like that and they only have the best and good memories of him. And now they see their daddy as yes, coin toss playable. captain tomorrow Holy smokes, what goes through your mind now and how has this changed your whole outlook on life? My whole outlook has changed. I mean, I get to spend more time with my kids. I, I spend it and I, I love it. I mean, I cherish the moments I get to spend with them and her. They're the best of me. Doctor, what do you think sets your team apart from all the other teams? One of the things that you have said is that there's such a camaraderie and a family feel when you're working on each individual patient? Yeah, these are uh, excellent people, uh, well-trained, highly motivated, they leave nothing on the table, and I think they appreciate the same thing that I do. When you can see a patient reunited with their family and resuming a life after a, a tragic uh, onset of illness, it's everything to us, and I think that's what drives us. Doctor, thank you for being here, and thank you for doing what you do. Jake, Congratulations on your continued recovery. You are doing fantastic. And Sarah, you hang tough. You're such a good mom and a good wife and a good partner. And I'm so happy that you guys are all together here talking to us. Just such a blessing. Thank you. Thank you. Remember,
The Chiefs Chargers game is tomorrow night, Saturday at Arrowhead. So you want to be there and you want to see Jake because he is the coin toss captain and you're going to bring your little boy out on yeah. the field to do it with you. So he's co-captain. He is. Your eight-year-old son. Yeah. Well done.